Hello viewers, Assalamu alaikum. This is Nurul Anwar Masood. Welcome to my new video series on uh, appointment management. Uh, actually, it is a, a, a small project. I'll try to cover uh, most of the important uh, topics on Oracle Apex. Uh, if you complete the uh, uh, whole uh, tutorial, I hope you can uh, make any uh, project with Oracle Apex. You see, I have already opened appointment management uh, software. First of all, I want to uh, uh, show you overview. Our project will be like this. Okay, this is home page uh, on top uh, our uh, appointment status. And uh, here is a navigator we can uh, access uh, access uh, page uh, access uh, page directly from here if we click on this uh, uh, like button and uh, bottom you see a chart uh, in the left side uh, you see meeting host provider menu client and visitor menu appointment menu an appointment calendar, monthly calendar, meeting service, meeting panel, and administrator. I uh, have signed in uh, with the administrator role. That is why I see all of the uh, menu. Uh, so uh, if I click on the administration, you see a dashboard. Our administration dashboard, uh, we can create uh, or add new user from here um, and uh, uh, provide them uh, three role admin, user, or sub admin. Actually, uh, I'll try to uh, cover uh, Oracle um, FX default authentication and authorization, authorization and uh, role. Uh, creation. If we uh, want to uh, make a, a small type of uh, project, we can uh, uh, we can use Oracle Apex default authentication and authorization authorization system. In future, if you uh, want to make a big size project, in that uh, in that uh, uh, time, you must use uh, uh, your uh, customize. Uh, your customized um, authentication and authorization. You um, want to uh, make a dynamic menu and dynamic role. In that case, you must use uh, uh, your uh, customized authentication and authorization. Um, uh, as as our uh, project is a small type, so I um, think. Uh, uh, Oracle default authentication and authorization is perfect for me. So now uh, um, I, I, I am going to um, show you uh, how to do function, how to do function uh, through this uh, appointment management. Okay. I'm going to um, open this another uh, browser. I will access only uh, a user that has a uh, user role. This user, uh, this user uh, got only the menus that is uh, assigned this role. Okay, if this user want to access uh, uh, appointment, uh, he can access. Okay, nice. Uh, if he want to uh, calendar, you see sufficient privileges, user is not sub administrator. Okay, and uh, meeting services, he can access and the meeting panel insufficient privilege okay and uh, a normal user can uh, create a provider and create a client new client 
and uh, uh, take uh, appointment and create meeting server. A normal user can uh, take uh, um, appointment and appointment uh, we see um, uh, the uh, list of uh, appointment here. Okay. Uh, we see priority status and actions. Okay. Uh, priority may be uh, urgent or normal and status uh, uh, visitor visited or visitor can uh, cancel uh, his uh, appointment his or her appointment we can um, uh, do action from here okay okay nice uh, we can edit uh, appointment see appointment you can edit from here okay client appointment history uh, in the bottom we'll uh, see uh, client appointment history okay now i'm going to create uh, or uh, take an appointment so first of all I'm going to type phone number. Like this. And time. Also, we can uh, select from here, train 30. Okay. And I'm going to select from here 11 30 8. okay people two people region maybe uh, maybe uh, discussion about Okay. and priority may be urgent or normal uh, client information client name may be Mr. Uh, Faisal or email Faisal at example.com and designation manager department company abc ltd or phone number like this address dhaka bangladesh okay now create an appointment you see our appointment here the date is 23 May 23 May okay this one we can edit this from here and our uh, uh, client will automatically save in uh, in a particular table if we see this customer, this phone number, this customer, Mr. Faisal, client or visitor, see, automatically created Okay, now we can uh, create a meeting. We can create a meeting, but uh, Imran user don't have any um, uh, permission to create a meeting. 
okay he only can send a visitor uh, to the meeting you see appointment information today's all of the appointment information will be uh, here okay if we try to add uh, yes uh, at first open a new meeting for the day we don't have any uh, meeting available for today okay now i'm going to create a meeting okay no rule this user has uh, administrator access so meeting panel meeting panel no meeting meeting services you see new meeting view new meeting view new meeting or view we can create a meeting and our host maybe this one and create meeting period okay new meeting period has been created okay if we see uh, meeting panel you see uh, meeting host mr mustafa azad mujiuddin director and visitor is available okay Vis visitor uh, visitor is uh, not sent but uh, uh, visitor has available okay uh, okay fine now user can uh, sent visitor uh, for uh, doing meeting okay okay now send a visitor this visitor okay plus okay okay we should uh, uh, descending this uh, for uh, showing top of the uh, top of the table this user uh, has been sent now we check uh, meeting panel and you see automatically i uh, show a visitor mr foisal managing manager all information we will see okay visitor number 2 and appointment code number and uh, start time start time okay and uh, duration uh, running okay now if uh, uh, our meeting is complete then we can uh, take uh, some note take some note after completing uh, after complete note then current meeting okay here okay nice okay current meeting done done yes we see visitor is not available for today uh, from uh, for today there is no a uh, visitor available and uh, meeting host uh, want to close the meeting for today okay so i'm going to close the meeting for today all of the meeting close for today yes okay any meeting is not open at this moment meeting is closed here is appointment appointment uh, appointment we if we uh, click on this you see this okay if you click on this uh, it has been uh, gone in edit mode you can edit from here and if we uh, put on our mouse, uh, mouse cursor we see uh, information
20 May, we see um, our appointment. If we cursor on time, we see details. Okay. From here, we can uh, create uh, a new appointment. And if we click on uh, already created uh, appointment, we can uh, edit, the, edit them and see list, see all of the list from here. Okay. If uh, we click on home button, And we see today's total appointment one, cancel zero, total visited one, and total visited person two. Okay, uh, no rule have uh, uh, administrator have uh, uh, no rule have uh, no rule. Mr. No rule has uh, uh, administrator role, that is why he can access appointment. And he can access calendar and he can access all of the navigator button. Okay, Administ administration, we can uh, create a new user from here. If I create a new user, uh, new user. Alep and sub admin Abu Talib and designation programmer password okay educator okay if you click on users see Manage user access, all of the users here. Okay. And uh, we can see activity, top user, top user. And uh, we can uh, change theme style from here. Redo and other if we uh, what to change we can change from here and we can uh, change our password from here okay viewers uh, from uh, my next video i will start our uh, main project i hope you will with me thank you very much